Steve and I went to one movie, and then Karen and the three girls went to a movie right beside us, so that was kind of fun. Um, I've got, yeah, well, we didn't miss boxes because I just got home a little bit ago. I don't, uh, all I have is a couple cards, and I have one thing to show you. Yeah, uh, a couple of nights ago, somebody asked us to show, there's um, the black cats. Well, we were looking for black cats. Um, maybe this will be your test night. You guys know how many black cats we have? Black cats, not not um, half and halfers. <laughs> well, okay, for those that are saying in five, are you counting... Um, you're probably counting Donna, but yeah, I guess she's kind of kind of a black one. But the black ones that I think add black black are Picasso, Hannah, Dunnikin, and Pocus. So that would be four. Yeah, I can do that. Give me a minute here. This, yeah, there you go. Yeah, yeah. So we have not found Pocus, so that means this one is Dunnikin, and um. Dunnikin and Pocus are so close in size now that it is hard to tell them apart. But if you were to pick them up, Pocus's, is, um, or um, uh, Dunnikin's belly, he's got the, like the horseshoe right here. And they both have the white on the neck. And I think, I think uh, Pocus's is a little bit bigger. And if you could, you could reach through the camera and then check under their tail because one has a P and one has a D under the tail. No, just kidding. No, just kidding. But you could tell if one's a boy and one's a girl. Dunnikin's, a, Dunnikin's the boy and Pocus is the girl. And then, there we go. Here. Where was she? Up, up there? There's Pocus. See, Pocus is a little bit bigger. And they're white. I mean, really, truly, to look at it from the cam is darn close. Pocus is a little bit bigger. Their personalities are a little bit different, too. Yeah, here's Pocus. So these are the two. It's sometimes hard for probably you guys to tell apart. <laughs> and then the other two black ones is, um, Connie, thank you. I loved it. <laughs> Oh, is he so sleepy? This is Picasso. You remember Picasso was a baby when he first came, our boy. And he does not have the white under the chin. Yeah, crazy little Picasso is right. And he's purring up a little storm already. And then the babyest of the black. Yeah, that would be you. Here's little Hannah. And there's her little shaved belly right now, you can tell. How old is Picasso? Oh, I can tell you here. Oh, i got to find my health book. And you're just purring up a storm, too, aren't you? You're just purring up a storm, too. Picasso's birthday is August 5th, August 5th, so, wow, so he's like four months old already, yeah, incredible, um, I wanted to show you, remember I had said yesterday that Judy S.'s um, two kids had um, sent a couple items, and, um, Oops, let me get that out of my way here. Oh, Riley. Yeah. Boy, Canton, you're good. Riley Riley is in um, Kitty City, and if Riley was in here, you would be able to tell Riley because he's got a tear in the ear. Um, but one of the things I didn't get to show you from last night was her one um, family. Remember, it was Kit Kat. And then the other one is a Marty and, and 
uh, Cheryl and Adam and uh, Troy and they're the ones who donated uh, this here, the window perch, which is pretty cool. So we will find a place to put this up too. These are really nice, the kitties like these. So thank you. And then we did get we did get two cards today. And we'll go over these. Oh, this one is, I just am looking at them. This one is for Uncle Eric. This is from Larray. And I will, um, yeah, maybe. I'll, uh, I'll take this. I'll make sure Uncle Eric gets this in the next day or two. So I'll take that down. And then this one is from Bubbles, uh, who is from Washington. And Sunny says, Merry Christmas, it says on the back. So we'll do this card or letter. It says, Dear Jackie, Kitties and Volunteers, please accept our donation as thanks for all you do to protect the feline animal kingdom. We so appreciate all your hard work and service to the feline community. And this is this is from Sunny, I believe, the kitty. Uh, since we are now here, or since we are new here at FFRC as webcamers, we would like to take a pledge to you and your center by donating each month to feed and care for all the animals in your no-kill center. We have a 10-year-old Scottish Fold, long-haired calico purebred, and she has brought us hours of enjoyment and companionship. So please accept this donation on behalf of our cat, oh, Abigail, <laughs> Abigail Von Fussy Budget and ourselves. God bless. Cynthia and, and Marcus N. I recently posted a picture of Abby on FFRC Facebook profile. I'll have to make sure I catch that. So thank you. Thank you very much, Cynthia and Marcus. And they are from Washington. Um, we will put your, your money that you sent to 100% good use for the Rescue Center, and I appreciate that so much. Wanted to give you an uh, update. Uh, your, so your cam name must be Bubbles, Bubble Ladoo. Um, wanted to give you an update on the washer. Uh, it was the bearings that went out, and he said he didn't think that the bearings had been well lubricated. So um, when they have to do these, fix the bearings, they actually change like, what did, what did he say, like two-thirds of the whole tub, uh, or two-thirds of the whole washer? So there's lots and lots of brand new parts in a brand new washer. So not to worry because he well lubricated it. It is not going to um, dry out in there. And um, it's all 100% covered under the warranty. So that was fine. That was good. And um, so it's working just like new. And uh, someone had asked me to show Katie's bag. So since this is a slow night, this would be a good time to do that. Let me grab those. big boy bag, those nylon reinforced bags uh, these all come from either like farm bags or dog food bags or cat food bags and they're not the paper ones they are they're they're plastic and then they're reinforced with nylon these are f just five dollars and if you plus there's um, we're, we'll probably have to do like $2 of shipping now uh, because I've been running into a little bit more where the shipping's a little more costly than what I thought. I'll show them to you, and if you do want any of these, just send me an email saying if it doesn't matter what cat or what dog or if there's a specific cat or dog or some of them are um, bird seed bags or corn seed, so just... If you want them, all you have to do is let me know, and if there's if that one's left, then I'll be glad to send it to you. See, and they are they are nylon rein, or plastic, I guess you could say, reinforced all over um, with the nylon. These are the wild bird ones, and I've got like five of these. So this bag is all the same. These are all wild bird um, bags. And then this one here is kind of cute. It's what we use for the chickens. It's the scratch feed, and it's got the black handle on it. And they hold a lot. 
Then this one is a, a kitty one. It's Purina one. They're really cute. That one's Purina one. This one's a little wider, and it's the Purina dog, and it has it looks like a lab on it. <laughs> Carolina Ash, you're pretty sneaky. There's another one. Now this one, instead of wider, is taller, and it's got the yellow lab on it. This one they did the wider one, and it's the doggy one, Karina one. Sorry, kitty. There's another yellow lab, black candle, and then a doggy, another doggy one, Karina one. So if you are interested in them, they're they're like five, but if you could include a couple dollars for shipping, that would be cool too. And if you are interested, um, just just pop it on my email, and I'll be glad. I'll I'll get back with you uh, right away on those. Ellie is on tonight in case she's on I don't think she'll be a chat but I think she's a lurker this is tw Twinkle this is the one that you sent the monkey toy for God bless you and uh, I just wanted to tell you thank you for doing that She's just been purring and purring today. And uh, someone had asked me, uh, it was probably a few days ago, I'm just a little behind, is uh, they wanted to see Ernestine and Emmeline. So this one, of course, is, is our Emmeline. Uh, her face is looking awesome right now. Ears and her face, her mouth even looks a little bit better. Yeah, and she's got a little bit of a tummy, but we don't make fun of her. Yep, I'll show you the new one, too. And we did have an adoption today also. Vets left. Um, she just did. Uh, this lady had come in with the idea that she wanted to adopt vets. And she went all around and looking at everything. And she ended up still staying with vets, which was really nice. So um, she'll, she promised that she would get us an update in a couple of days. I'll show you the new girl. This is Raina. This is the Himalayan. And uh, the breeder had on her uh, papers that you can send in to register them as that breed that uh, she's a, a chocolate. Uh, but gosh, she's ever so nice. This family took, this was a really hard, hard, hard thing for this owner to give this cat up. They love this cat. Uh, there was just a real sad situation in their family that made it where they had to give her up and um, she's going to be fine. It sounds like her household where she was at before uh, that this was the meet and greet. You know how I call some of these guys the meters greeters. They're the ones that run to the door for people and that's how she was there. She likes dogs. She likes kids. So she's going to be fine but um, their regular groomer is on an extended is off for a while so 
Um, she did miss a couple grooming appointments, and she does have some mats on her tummy. So we've got her partially shaved on her tummy, but we got a little ways to go around her chest, and we'll work on it again tomorrow. She is uh, going to be three on, I think it's March 18th. Yeah, she she really is going to be fine here. It, I don't think it'll take long to get her adopted. Well, they saw each other this morning because we showed them both together, but um, Cutter, Cutter had kind of a little rough day today. He's thrown up a few times, and he had a little bit of diarrhea. So um, do you know where Cutter is? If we can find Cutter right away, we'll we'll get him so you can see the difference. Oh, is he sleeping? Oh, let's just leave him be. He's sleeping in the bottom of one of the big condos, so we're just going to leave him be. He's been up quite a bit today. Um, KW might be adopted. The, the family that is coming back to adopt Nebraska... I uh, loves KW, but I, I won't let KW go yet till we have a little more time with that new treatment that we're doing um, with him. But his neck looks awesome right now. And this lady used to work for a vet, so I think I feel real confident in letting him go with her that, that they'll keep up with that treatment if he needs it. And uh, I know, <laughs> I know that about Erie. I hope that works. Yeah, I hope that goes because Air, um, Angie and Bill would be awesome for Erie. Okay, you want to go back to your pen? I think I got a little sneeze or wheezer. Okay, I'm going Yeah, I wrote down the dates today just in case you want to know. Um, Cessna is going to be picked up 12-22. Whoa, wait a minute. Is that right? Damn it. Yeah, that's Thursday. And then uh, the lady who's going to adopt Praline did commit today all the way to Praline and Chia. And they're going to pick these two girls up on the 26th or the 27th. Uh, Donna and Weasley, as we know, is going to go to California later in January. Gonzo is going to be picked up 12:24 around noon. Uh, Nebraska, uh, we don't know for sure when they're going to pick Nebraska up. And then at that time, I'll talk to her more about Curdy, Curdy Willie. And then Tweeny, um, as you know, Pam and Rich are going to take her the third week of March. So. We've got, oh, oh, I got some other good news for you. Um, speaking of Uncle Eric and uh, Larray, I will get this to him probably tomorrow, if not tomorrow, the next day. Um, uh, Eric, Uncle Eric's uh, uh, sister is there, and uh, I checked in with him today, and things are going pretty good, pretty good with uh, uh, Noogie and Nuki. And they are they're keeping the names because they're still technically FFRC cats. So his sister really likes both of them. So she's been spending a lot of time just sitting on the floor playing with them and drawing them out and uh, just playing. That's what she's doing is just playing with the kitties down there. Uh, we haven't heard yet back from Jeepers. I uh, imagine we will. Anani update is doing awesome. He's doing really good out there. And this is what was cool. Yes, where it is Alaska. Where did I say? Anyhow, yeah, it's Alaska. Um, you guys all know how once or twice a week we open up the door to uh, Kitty City and just let the cats out. And they cruise around out there on the farmyard and up here on the sun porch and generally hang out. And if we leave them out for a few hours, um, then they come back when it's time to eat. And... We left the door open, and we just leave it open, and they kind of stroll in and out off and on all day. And Anani was out quite a bit that day, and this was one day last week, and uh, he he went right back on in. So that was a really good sign to me that he's happy there. Uh, I missed something. Anani update. And maybe Remo. Remo will go home on the 24th. 
Remo? What's up with Remo? You guys know something I don't know? Yeah, I think you'd be happy, Nuki, with little Nuki, four-legged Nuki. Casco, are you being good? Come on. We'll put him back in Cat's Corner Room for the night. Steve is doing good. He's very happy to have his surgery date. It's January 10th. Thank you for asking. Yeah, January 10th. We finally got it. Um, I know. I do. I think you're right, Queen. I think Merci is a little bit off. Although today she was out, and I was thrilled to see that, that Merci was, um, she was cruising over here, checking out the new things over here. Um, Siri has a chronic lifetime nasal problem. She's had it her entire eight years, and uh, she's doing great, though. I mean, it, she does. You can hear her. It's wheezy. We had it double-checked on Saturday. It is not in her throat. It is not in her lungs. It's right there in the nasal passage. Um, she's She is always, it, who, if somebody adopts her, they have to realize that that is a chronic, long-time problem that she's always going to have. Um She's been checked out. There's no polyps, things like that. I think I missed something. I know tomorrow, tomorrow we hear from the animal rescue site. We saw, wait a minute. Oh, how many cans of food do we go through in a day? Well, when we, a uh, month ago, three weeks ago, we were going through about, um, what was it, 38 cans a day? That includes the the outside ones, too. No, somebody, I think, was just coughing. And I missed something. Bill Bill wanted to adopt. Yeah, that would be Aaron, or Erie. I have to adopt. Well, Erie. Erie had a handicap, kind of. Her, his fractured hip. Yeah. <laughs> Poor Bill. I know, I know. It is uh Love My Pets on. I gotta check in with him yet tonight and get a time from him. No, Powder's actually still sleeping. I just saw down there. It wasn't him. Look at that. Oh my gosh, these guys, I just love them. We we saw that Sherlock Holmes. Steve liked it. I, I wasn't too keen on it, but I was kind of tired. I kept wanting to fall asleep. No, I haven't given Fair her meds. I will here in a minute. He appreciates you guys. I bet he, I know he would. <laughs> oh, you guys are funny. And they the girls went to see, oh, which one was it? It wasn't the Chippy uh uh, oh, shoot, it wasn't, uh, I don't remember what one they did see. <laughs> yeah, poor Bill. Yep, I, I had some Reese's today and popcorn tonight. Um, oh, and he's going to take it Thursday night? Okay, well, then I'm going to call Jennifer. Um, Carrie, thank you for telling me that. I'll call Jennifer today and make sure that they're going to be home Thursday night. I our, I want to see that too, Carso. The we bought a zoo. It's not here yet. It's it's another week or two. Yeah, they they had a big sign up, and we've been watching advertisements on that. <laughs> yeah, you guys. I would like to have seen. I have to go back maybe and catch the chat with poor Bill. Yeah, the girls are doing good. I don't know if you guys noticed. Um, but Kendra, the older one, had a big old goose egg on her left temple. Um, the, she got clobbered by a flashlight. Kendra, Kellen, the, the youngest one, was swinging it around. And she walloped Kendra by accident. It was awful. Got a big old goose egg. 
I think there is some misunderstanding regarding TASCO's issues. Uh, I think I think there might be a little un misunderstanding. I know that he does get carried away, but most of the time he's he gives them baths, and I've watched him, especially the last few weeks, and he does. He bathes, bathes them heavy and hard, but he doesn't progress much past that most of the time. Um, so, you know, I, I really don't worry about him too much. He gets a little little bit overboard sometimes but he's he's nice he's he doesn't he doesn't mean to be overly aggressive yeah it, Kendra has these little issues with her small bones in her feet and she's I guess she's broken uh, two in one foot and one in the other so she's had that cast on quite a while yeah he's not mean no Tasco's awesome Bill <laughs> said that you're brutal I can just hear Bill yeah he's a lover Right. Kendra is, what is she now, 10? <laughs> yeah, thanks, Nika Ross. Yeah, he's a good boy. <laughs> yeah, that's probably, that's probably what's going on with him, Carolina Ash. Oh, thank you, Nuki. I appreciate that. I'll tell Karen that you said that. The 13th of next month? Cool, Queen. I'd love it. I I would love that. Aw, thank you, Peach. Appreciate that. Yeah, mm -hmm. we'd love to have you visit. Well, I think I'm going to just uh, walk around and check everybody's bellies from surgery and on the girls, make sure everybody's okay, and um, then uh, get my scooping done. I'll be coming. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I am thrilled when, when we get web cameras here. It's really awesome. All right. Well, I'm going to go around and get everybody's tummies checked and get, um, yeah, Bets. Hi, Bets. Did you see where your the four-legged Bets was, was adopted today? Ah, uh, oh, yeah, I know, Queen, that you like Chaplin. Well, I got shortchanged on sleep last night, so I'm hoping to get a little better sleep tonight. Yeah, Bets, you got adopted. Oh, Bets. Well, I try not to name a use the same name twice, and you would not have to do that donation. I know that's near and dear to you. Maybe we could do Betsy. I haven't had a Betsy before. I have a few of the others I have to use up. I've got, I keep track of the names on, on my desk. Yeah, Betsy's nice. Hi, Bantry. Okay. Well, I'm going to go, go check on the bellies. So I will, um, no, they'll be in later and we'll, they'll let me know about KW. But his neck is doing really good. Alaska, Mimi, that's good. Yeah, sometime we'll have to, well, we've done some of the states, but certainly not all of them. Kiss the Bellas. No, we haven't had a Swiffer. Wildfire, yep. Or Gossamer, I know, we could, we still got some good names. Okay, I'm going to go get my checking done. Check in. Hey, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Your mommy's on there. Say hi, Mama. Say, I'm trying to get my hair to grow long because I need it to keep warm. He's purring. Him and Donna, they just totally crack me up. <laughs> Are your little toesies? Are your little toesies wet? Oh, we just love you guys, don't we? Yeah. Uh, 
All right, buddy. Why don't you get down there with your your friends? Hi, Asha. Come on, Asha. Oh, come on. One quick one quick look at the cam. Tell everybody how much you love them. Just tell them. See, I just love everybody. Yep. Whoops, wait a minute. You're slipping, girl. Oh. She just soaks right in. Don't you? Mm. She's purring and purring. She is. Hasn't she gotten incredibly dark? Remember when, if you look at her early picture, she's really, really light. You good girl? Yes. Are you a kisser girl? Are you a kisser girl? Mm. You, oh, yeah, I love you. You ready? Oh. <laughs> Now, see, Casco is licking Wiggles, and Wiggles is laying there all the way by himself. He's not biting it. Casco has his head sopping wet. Oops, now he's getting work. I'm just going to watch him and see what happens. And unless he gets a little mean. Casco, I was just talking nice about you. Okay. I was just praising you to the hill, buddy. I was. I was just praising you to the hill. Say night night. I'm gonna go in my room tonight. Isn't he blasted handsome though? Oh my gosh, I just think he's really handsome. I know you love me. You guys all have fish breath tonight. You do. Yep. He's got the prettiest, prettiest eyes. Yeah, so just sometimes I know his little love bites get, they do get carried away once in a while, but most of the time he's awesome. Huh. Come on. Hey, Sarah, you ready? You want your medicine? Then we got to check a few tummies and then we got to, I got to go to bed. She's watching. Come on, Sarah. <laughs> I'm telling you, I love it when she does that. No, no, Shasta. This is for Sarah. This is for Sarah. No, no. Oops, watch your toesy. Did you do it? Or are you carrying it over? Figure out where are you going with that? Come on, I want to make sure you eat it. That a good girl. That a good girl. That's a good kitty. 